Hi, I'm Anna Berry with Unscripted, and I'm thrilled to be at Zova Rehab Center at 91st in Yale with brother and sister team here helping people with lots of physical issues, chiropractic care, and massage, cranial sacral therapy. So thank you, Dr. Mike, for joining me, and thank you, therapist Amy. All right, so let's talk with you, Dr. Mike. You help people when they are in pain, and you've been doing this for quite some time. Tell me about yourself. Yeah, so I've been... Um, doing body work originally with a chiropractor for 16 years. I'm also a strength and conditioning specialist, so I mm -hmm. integrate that in. How can we get people stronger, whether they're doing CrossFit or whether they're just starting their first 5K or, you know, they're just, again, like if they're at the desk and they're just kind of hunched over and their neck is hurting, how they can loosen that up and open that up. Well, let's talk a little bit about chiropractic care. We yeah. know how important the spine is, um, but some people might not know how certain ailments are directly related to spinal dysfunction or subluxation, as you call it. So talk a yeah. little bit about that. Yeah, so what one main thing we look at is structure and posture, just how the spine is aligned, um, how the nerves come out, and um, how that affects the rest of the body. Um, a big thing with us too is just extremities as well, because we deal a lot with like shoulders, hips, knees, toes, um, how the muscles work with that. And then also functionally how somebody's moving, whether they're in a sport such as baseball, mm -hmm. soccer, um, gymnastics. Or at a desk all day. Um, or, or at a desk all day. <laughs> or in a our hunch or posture, which I mean, of course, a lot of us are. So it's getting that correct and getting that aligned. So it's not just classic chiropractic getting this, just, you know, just cracking the spine, so to speak, but it's figuring out ways to get it moving, but also to strengthen it in certain positions, to loosen muscles up. If shoulders are forward, to figure out how to expand those open, mm -hmm. maybe to strengthen those. And we use a lot of different therapies for that. You give people things to do here, but also also to take with them into their home everyday life so that they can um, sustain their health. Yeah. But then you often refer to your sister who is a therapist and you, yeah. you deal things from a, a different, more holistic approach through massage, cranial sacral therapy. Amy, tell me a little bit about you and your approach to healing and health. Yeah, well I, I started as a massage therapist and then I got deeper into body work. And so the two main modalities I do that are not as prevalent are craniosacral therapy and visceral manipulation. So I work a lot in the fascial systems of the body. So the audience is going, what? So, <laughs> cranial sacral therapy, break that down a little bit. Yeah, so craniosacral is a really gentle yet deeply effective way to release restrictions around the membranes, the membranes that go around the brain and are continuous around the spinal cord. So the head and the tail are connected. So what happens to the head can ha show up down here. You have a tailbone fall, it can show up here. Mm -hmm. So there's a structural way very gently to align the bones in the head and um, get people more functional and out of pain. There's also a nervous system component. So it helps with things like anxiety and some sleep disorders, pain. And you help adults and children. Oh yes, I work on children as well. Which is wonderful because sometimes kids don't know how to express what is going on inside of them and so mm -hmm. these modalities can help. So I love how you two work together, brother and sister, and then you also have another chiropractor here yes. and you bring all of these, um, these ancient teachings and you bring it to a holistic approach to help someone feel better and in life don't we just want to feel good, right? So Dr. Mike and therapist Amy, thank you for all you do. Zova Rehab right off 91st in Yale. Thank you both and thank you for watching Unscripted.